Hello friends, my name is Ghost Raven and let me welcome you back to my gameplay to my let's play of the Assassin's Creed 2. I hope you're having a good day, but if you don't, don't worry that things will get eventually better and you will get through anything, trust me, okay? Right now just sit back, relax, enjoy and let's get into this, let's go into the story mode once again. Ghost Raven, here we comes. And let's go back to Florence, in the 15th century. Leap of fate. Yeah, let's let's go. Let's go back. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Standing next to the enemies. It's not a good idea. Okay, let's let's see the map first. So we got a bunch of viewpoints. You know we should do those first. Sounds like a good idea. I'll take this treasure first. Where is it? You know what? You asking for it. You will get it. You will get what you want. And you too. Come on, man. Come on, attack me. Oh, no. Okay, <laughs> luckily. Now let me grab you. Dang. Yeah, that's what you're gonna get. Let me get on the roof. Oh, I can use thieves now. At least I think. Yeah, so some mark. Yeah, these are the thieves I can use. But let me just see. Let me get down. Where's that chest? Oh, probably down here. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, on the balcony of some kind. Let me get through here. Hello, how you doing? Can I talk to you? <laughs> In some way. I'm just seeing. I cannot climb that. Oh, nice shield, by the way. I cannot cross this either way. How you doing? Guys? Yeah, you tell me. I'm standing in place. <laughs> Not doing anything, but thank you very much. Oh, I don't want to read this. Let me see this. Okay, let's go into this viewpoint. Yeah, and where is it? Like 70 meters from here. Area not yet available. Yeah, I know that. We can cross this, but only for a while and you will get <laughs> desynchronized. So let's not do that just yet. Let's be careful around this. Uh, but I could use that <laughs> traveling point across. I'll probably break my arm with this grabbing ability of mine, but yeah, what can you do? Nothing. Yeah, let me let me get onto this. On this tower. Yeah, nice and easy. Nice and easy, exactly. Now let's check the surroundings. What is in here? What can we see? Okay, a whole bunch of stuff. A whole bunch of buildings. Okay, let's get down. Nice. The sixth one. There should be another treasure to be found. So let's go in here. Sorry, just coming through. I need to go through here. There should be some place. Oh Jesus, are you using the same? <laughs> Same lines over and over and over again. Okay, it's here. Let's go down. Slowly. Don't you? Don't you get hurt? <laughs> Pain deductor is quite expensive, so we need to be careful. Around our health. Good. Okay. Thank you very much. Let's go around this. Yeah, I should leave this. Oh, once again, these guys. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, there's where <laughs> my girlfriend lives. Yeah, uh, I was in this window before. Yeah, good to know that. Too bad it's closed. But, yeah. Nothing you can do about it. Let's check this out. This chest. There are some, some more we can, we can take. I mean, not too many. Should be quite alright. Let's go for these. They will be probably hidden in a bank, so I can you now demonstrate the use of thieves. How can you use them to your advantage? Maybe it will be like that. Let me just see. Let me get there first. No, oh, some kind of church. Nice. The minimap is much more detailed than the last one. I mean, it was just a bunch of white thingies going on so definitely improvement in this part yeah luckily it's not a bank so 
I can go into the balcony like nothing. Good. That wasn't be <laughs> physically possible, I would say, doing something like that. But yeah, Ezio is the boss, so but where is it? I need to go through here, I guess. Is it in here somewhere? Oh yeah, down here. Definitely. Okay, let's go. Jump down. Good. Let me take this. Good. And let's see this thing. Let's go to this position. Grab some more. Okay. Then we will do those story missions. It shouldn't take too long, like five minutes or something. I'll create a timestamp if you don't want to see this. You can jump right into the any mission you want to, basically. So, yeah, there's a choice for everyone if you want to do things like that. Whoa, what the hell happened? Jesus Christ, my game crashed. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Jesus, what the hell was that? I need to turn it on. <laughs> I thought my power went off. That would be even worse. Jesus Christ, let's do this again. Oh man. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. I surely wasn't. Oh man. Are you kidding me? Okay, let's go back. Yeah, another thing I should talk about. I mean, this game has certainly some issues on PC. Besides being, there's um, not particularly good for it. It also has some stability issues, as you can see. So, good stuff. I mean, but luckily, the saving works just fine, you know? There's no manual save, but I'll just save. Works after every collectible, after every minute, basically, so you won't lose too much progress. But that was something else. Jesus, that kind of freaked me out, to be honest. <laughs> Need to be careful around these thingies. Okay, where is it? Oh, totally lost focus. <laughs> Six meters, but where? Okay, let me check this side. Oh, there you are, on the balcony, of course. Oh man, they kind of freaked me out. But yeah, this is what you get. Nothing's... <laughs> no one is perfect, so... Yeah. And I don't mind too much, you know, some crashes. When they happen, like, occasionally, like, when you're playing, like, 50-hour game and the game crashes, like, two times or three, it's quite fun, okay, I get it. And when the game is complex, you know, and using different thingies at the same time and, you know, the code can crash occasionally, I get that. You know, and when the player is doing stupid things, also, so <laughs> yeah, it can, it can get dangerous, so I can, I get it, okay, it's part of the gaming I would say I mean yeah I'm <laughs> I would like to call myself uh, as a really open-minded gamer you know I don't really mind you know like well frame rates and things like that I was born and raised on <laughs> low frame rates you know like um, uh, who was that in Dark Knight oh Jesus I forgot his name you know I was born <laughs> in the darkness he said something like that. God, what was his name? Yeah, and I was born in a <laughs> low frame rate era. I was lucky to have a um, game being played on 15 FPS on 20 and things like that. You know, I, first time I played Assassin's Creed 2 on my old notebook. Poor thingy that it was. <laughs> Let me tell you that. And it was running like, well, terribly. <laughs> Yeah, 20 FPS, no exaggeration, but I still enjoy this game a whole lot, you know, and it has a special place in my heart. But there are no thieves to be found, so I cannot use them for this. No, they aren't. Okay, I will have to fight you, if that's okay. <laughs> yeah, I know that, but I need to get inside. Yeah, I'm not so stealthy, but... I'm not killing anyone just yet, so I'm not the murderer. I'm just a criminal doing my thingy. Yeah, there you go. After half his health, he's gone. Oh, come on. <laughs> you gonna run away? Yeah, you better run. 
Yeah, after half his health is basically <laughs> depleted, um, you can finish him off with a counter attack. So that's quite fine and good to know. If you want to play this game, you know, that's a good hint to get. But when you get Hidden Blades, which is way, way off from where we are now, well, you will be able to finish every enemy, I think, with a single blow. And finally, you can deflect with a Hidden Blade. You will see that later, much later. We are just noblemen so far, you know, doing our thing, stealing from the rich. And then giving to ourselves, which doesn't make too much sense, but anyway. Let's climb this. Climb this huge building we read about in the database last episode. Oh, come on. Get up there. Ezio, come on. Man, you can do this. Oh, you need to. You're so picky. Let me tell you that. Let's climb on this. Oh, nice. And through here. Come on. Good, good. Now I need to get even higher. Mmm, terrific. But, which way to go? Oh, I think this way. This could be fine. Get down. But not too much down. <laughs> and let's get up here. Yeah, you will get this sense of pride and accomplishment. Yeah, I don't need to take it, I hope. <laughs> When you climb these buildings, because yeah, it's not like in Odyssey or Origins or Valhalla when you just press the button and he will climb. Not he, the character, which may be she, if you want to be specific. Yeah, they will climb every building like it's nothing. You just have to press up and climb button. But in here, you have to think about what you're doing. And even in Odyssey, I believe, there's a perk you can unlock, which basically eliminates all full damage, so it... It's basically throwing all the challenge out the window, and you don't have to be afraid about your health, and... Doing this cool stuff <laughs> in those games isn't as cool anymore, because... Yeah, you are not afraid of your life, so... Yeah, it's a bummer, really, to see those kinds of things. On these guys again. Now leave me alone. I don't want to fight you. I just want to collect these few more treasure chests. Get some money. They will be needed. I might tell you that for damn sure. No, it won't take too long. Already. As I said, you can skip it if you don't want to see this. But this is like I like to do things and how I like to play things. Okay, where is it? Probably on the other side. Let me take this one first. Let me climb on this. On these windows. By the way, where is the music? Where does the music go? Come on. Too bad. Never mind. Okay. That's quite alright. Probably from this other side. Let me check this out. Are there any guards? Whoa, don't hurt yourself. Oh, there's nobody guarding this bank. Good. Good, good, good. I will use this moment of laziness from the guards and take this with me. Yeah, like 3,000, almost 4,000 florins. That's a lot of money. I will need it on many scenes on different upgrades, which you're going to see. There's a whole bunch of things you can you can buy, you can earn, you can find a lot of secrets. So it's a great fun. And where is it exactly? Oh, there you are. Again on the balcony. Oh, don't you hurt yourself. Be careful. Good. I mean, I don't know if you can see this, but when I turn on the game. It feels <laughs> like it's stuttering for like five minutes or so. Not like stuttering terribly, but it feels like it's dropping frames and after five minutes or so it feels like it's loaded <laughs> completely and it's just run better. 
I don't know what's the deal with that. Maybe because it has to load all the assets and things like that. That would be my guess, but I'm not quite sure. I'm not a technical type. I studied the IT, but only for like one semester at the university and then... Well, I failed, so... <laughs> I'm not doing that already. Or anymore. I'm not doing that anymore. So that's what you're gonna get, I guess. When you're not that skillful in IT. Good, let's jump down. How many more do we have here? Let me check this. Oh, just one. Oh, that's quite nice. By the way, if you're interested, what is this? It's a fast travel station. And you can use the carriages to travel around different cities, but we don't need it just yet. I mean, there's a... There's a tailor. We can buy some upgrades, some clothes. Yeah. And things like that. So, yeah. We don't need that just yet. Any of this. No, oh, the music came back. <laughs> That's nice. Okay, let's get on a roof and let's do those missions. Finally, finally, if you stay <laughs> all the way through, I really, I'm really, truly happy. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. So, yeah, anyway, the last one. And we got two missions. One with Claudia and one with Pietro, is it? Let me just see this. Petruccio. Yeah, Petruccio Auditore. So he's 13, if I'm counting correctly. Yeah, he is. So he's a student, he's noble, young, so they have the two children. He's having a weak constitution. What does that mean? Soon after he was born. Yeah, apparently it didn't improve in time. Petruccio was pulled from the school due to illness when he was 12, so one year ago. And according to records from a family doctor, was confined to bed. Confined to bed? He seems fine to me, I, I would say. No other data exists after that. Oh, so it's probable that he eventually succumbed to his illness. We'll see, I guess. Okay, let's talk to you, buddy. Brother. Here, Petruccio. You should be in bed. I want those feathers. What for? It's a secret. If I get them for you, will you go back inside? Yes, I promise. You got strange eyes, to be honest. Like a golden one. What the hell is wrong with you? I mean, no joking, I'm, I know you're ill, but yeah, the golden eyes now are not part of that illness, I think, I would say. But yeah, Petruccio's secret. Obtain eagle feathers for Petruccio before he gets out in trouble for sneaking out of bed. So he's confined to bed. Okay, my bad. That was stupid and rude. I'm sorry about that. Call out all the feathers, or three of them in two minutes. Should be fine. How did you spot them <laughs> from that distance? God, your eyesight is good. Probably those golden eyes doing... Doing you favors. Okay, there's the second one. Yeah, I will take that. And the last one should be around here. Yeah, there you are. Good. Good. Okay, let's get back to our brother. Little brother. Whoa, okay. <laughs> He's probably lost track of me, of where I am. Jumping like, I don't know, frog on the roof. Again, these guys are going to kill me. Oh, I need to go. <laughs> I need to run. Dad, they tried to kill me. Come on, do something about them. Don't let them stay <laughs> near our home. Jesus, man. Okay, let's interact. Here, as promised. Grazie, brother. No. Oh. I'm looking forward to it. Don't mention it, brother. Okay, let's talk to Claudia, the last member of the family. Yeah, federal locations unlocked. There are basically collectibles 
same thing as Flex from the last game, but right now they're only 100. And in a strange way, which I don't want to, you know, talk about too much, they are connected to the main story with Petruccio. You will see in time. I won't tell anything else. Okay, Claudia. Auditore. So she's 15. Okay, I need to count this every time. So she's the third child, so... Yeah, Federico is the oldest one. I'm the second oldest. And there's Claudia and Petruccio. So four children. Okay. The first girl. Okay. And the only, I think. <laughs> Seems to have been a bit of a spoiled brat. Yeah, looks like her parents had raised a dowry by 1,000 foreigners after she scared away all her potential suitors. Oh good, a report from her school indicates she wants to take another girl for looking at her boyfriend. <laughs> it knocked her out cold. On a plus side, she's Ezio's sister, so you should be safe. Well, you may never know, I got sisters, so <laughs> they can be aggressive, let me tell you that. Rarely have experience like that, if you have a sister. Okay, let's talk to you. Just a joke, okay? Just a joke. You shouldn't keep things from me. It's Duccio. Oh, really? I think he's been unfaithful. Who told you this? The other girls. Are you kidding me? I thought they were my friends. Arpies. <laughs> You're better off without them. I love what? him. No, Claudia. You only thought you did. He should suffer for what he's done. <laughs> Wait here. I'll go have a word with him. Oh, Jesus. Such a change of tone. Did you see that? Jesus, I'm afraid of her. <laughs> she will become a murderer, I think, in the future. Find and punish Duccio. Oh, well, he's douchebag, let me tell you that. He even has a name similar to that word. I'm sorry if you came. <laughs> if your name is Duccio, I, I didn't mean no offense. I'm truly not. Okay. Let me see this. Let's find Duccio. But yeah. <laughs> okay, let me through. Just walking, walking by. Like nothing. Okay, let me fight this. Got so many monks walking around. And people <laughs> looking fancy. Okay, he should be somewhere around this around this square. Oh there you are. Somewhere around here. Oh, is that guy embracing the other girl? I think so. Yeah, that's him. It's beautiful. You douchebag. The best for you, amore mio. But what of Claudia? I thought you'd been promised to her. Her father said I could do much better than an auditore. Ah, oh, Virbante! Come, let us walk a bit. What? I had something <laughs> else in mind. Oh, Duccio. Mm. Oh, you're going to get it. Oh yeah, there's Ezio. Ezio, my friend. Think. You insult my sister. Parading around with this putana. Exactly. What are you talking about? I saw the gift you gave her. Heard the things you said. Maybe your sister shouldn't be so stingy with her virtue. Also. And now I'm going to break your face. Oh yo, you will try. So that's what you're all about. You want that physical love. Well, that's not a love, that's just a you being. <laughs> Shut up. Exactly. Yeah, you're not going to say anything else? Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. <laughs> I will need to go on the confession. Yeah. Get out of here. Do you? Yeah, you will get what you deserve. Yeah, thinking only about physical things. Like, you know what? There you go. Let me fight you some more. Yeah, there you go. Shut up. And I will. St <laughs> I will steal something from you. Oh, you poor little. Yeah, and stay down. Jesus, what an ass. <laughs> Sorry for my French. And, oh, we can do a beat-up event. 
Oh, since I'm in a mood <laughs> for some beatings, we can do that. Let me find this. It's another side mission, side activity. Just walking through. Hopefully that guy is alive. <laughs> Hopefully I didn't kill him. Jesus. That was... Yeah, I, I lost my nerves. I lost my temper. What can I tell? I didn't mean to kill him if I did. Just... That's how it went. <laughs> okay, there's a beat-up challenge. Around this corner. Oh, Garen. What happened? Why are you so sad? Let me talk to you. Oh, of course, my lady. Madonna. Woman scorned. Beat up the cheating husband. Okay, where can I find that guy? Where can I find him? All around here, in this green circle thingy. Okay, I might. Guys, leave me alone already. Come on, man. Let me get on the roof because I can't do anything about these guys. I don't want to fight them. No, you do not. I'm the Spider-Man. Let's get up. And let's see. Let's see this thing. Good. Jump around. Some more. Should be somewhere around here. No, that wasn't particularly a good idea to jump here. Need to go back. Good. Luckily, you're jumping like a monkey through these buildings like nothing. Hopefully, the game will not crash again. That's the first time it happened to me over all the uh, different videos and video games I did. <laughs> Funny. Okay, use Eagle Vision. Finally, we can use the first time we're using this. Yeah, it's a little improved. You can actually walk around when using it, so that's kind of interesting. And this golden one is these. Is that cheating husband, which I'm going to kill? <laughs> oh, jeez, I'm jump, <laughs> I'm jumping on his head like nothing. Yeah, exactly. You will get that. Come on, yeah. What? Yeah, that's better. Dirt. Better. That's not the way how to treat a lady. There you go. And stay down. And stay down. Yeah, you won't be using that any longer. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh man. Um, yeah, that's what you're gonna get. If you get in my way once again. Let's do this memory as well. I don't know how long in my recording. We'll check it. After some time. Yeah, but let's do this mission. In this episode as well. Hello, Doctor. Buongiorno, how you are doing today? Apparently, this is like around Christmas time, but there is no snow. It's like 27 December or something like that. I don't know, close to the New Year's Eve. So, yeah, good stuff. Father, I'm here. Are you are you home? Oh, there you are. Ezio, come in, son. I need these packages delivered to associates of mine in the city. I also need you to retrieve a message for me from a pigeon coop not too far from here. Va bene. I'll get it done. Come back here when you're finished. There are some things we need. To discuss and please my son stay out of trouble hmm? okay father ben ben i will try deliver two letters and retrieve third from a pigeon coop for giovanni then return to him oh nothing too hard can i read this oh giovanni has sealed this letter it will be wrong to open it are you kidding me what about this one Oh, secret, secret. Ah, oh, got you. So, which one is the closest one to my location? Uh, probably this one. Let's go to this destination first. Okay. Tailors. Did I read about this already? No, I didn't. 
Let's see this. I bet you can buy large bags to carry your equipment from the tailor. Maybe they can even change your outfit too. Yeah, that's something we can look into. We cannot do anything about that just yet. But yeah, in later episodes, we will definitely. Among Renaissance merchants, tailors belonged to the middle class and were paid well for clothing the rich in the latest fashions. Alright. Many were able to get close to their wealthy clients due to the in intimacy of their job and create lasting ties. Okay, that sounds funny, you know, like you making a dress for a lady. And <laughs> oh, geez, I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to. Okay, sounds like, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, that's one way how to get connections, right? How to get into relationships, I would say. You know, like you're looking good, Madonna. You know, and things like that. You you go for a walk with me on a date and things like that. You know, <laughs> I don't know. I just waking things up. You Hello there. No, idiota. He just happens to look exactly like this. <laughs> Give it here. <laughs> Don't worry, boy. We're not contagious. At least I'm not. What? <laughs> what the hell was that? Oh, man. <laughs> not holding back, aren't you? Okay. <laughs> Jesus, man. What the hell is wrong with this city? I don't have any words. I'm losing them left and right. Let's go into this place right now. Yeah. Good. Good. I should use Bene more. Seems I'm in Italy. Bene, Bene. I'm sorry for the accent. I never studied Italian language. I always wanted to though, so that's something. Okay, where should I go now? Oh, okay. There's someone. I have a delivery from Giovanni Alatore. Yes. See. Were you followed? No. Why would I be followed? Give me the package. Tell your father that they're moving tonight. He should as well. Who's moving? What's going on here? Mm. Wait, come back. Explain yourself. Ominous. Well, some trouble is brewing, I guess. Okay, someone is on the move, but what do you mean exactly? I'm not quite sure what is going on. Okay, let's get down. Not like that. There's a pigeon coop somewhere around here. Yeah, they are. Okay, let's open this up. Oh, a little pigeon. Pigeon, pigeon. Okay, what do you have for me? Can I read this? Hold. What? Q? No, that's the inventory. No, that's not it. I don't know what you mean. What is it, button? Oh, come on, man. I have no idea. What the hell was that? Why was I standing in place, doing nothing? Okay, but that is synced, so that's alright. Let's go back to our father. We have to warn him. And we didn't get into any trouble. I didn't beat anyone on my way, so that's uh, that's success, I would say, to some degree. Okay, let's go through this place. Can I go through, you know, like uh, yeah, roof <laughs> thingy? That's good, father. I got the letter, father. Oh. Whoa, what the hell? <gasps> Serezio! Thank God! What happened? Where is everyone? They took your father and brothers to the Palazzo della Signoria. To prison. And my mother. My sister. Ezio. Claudia. Are you alright? Yes, but mother... She's in shock. They... When she resisted... It's not safe here. Is there some place you can take them? Yes, yes, to my sisters. Good, do that. 
In the meantime, I'll go see my father. Be careful, Messer Ezio. The guards were looking for you as well. No, man, this is... This is tough. Read Giovanni's cell at the top of the Palazzo della Signoria and find out why he has been... He has been imprisoned. He will do this. We'll do this, but... In the next episode, I mean, this is a little tease, I'm already been coding far too long, so let me just stay at home. Can I sit on this bench? I cannot. Okay, so we'll just stay in here. That's something you can look forward to, I guess, so yeah. So that's what you're gonna get, but in the next episode, so yeah. Thank you very much for watching this video, my friends. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did, I hope you had fun. And if I made your day better, I'd be really, really glad, so thank you once again, stay healthy, stay safe. Like, dislike, subscribe, share, comment, do whatever you want. I'll be really happy if you leave me some kind of feedback, something to think about, something to talk about also, so yeah. And until we see each other again, God bless, bye bye my friends, and Raven out.